Hey guys, good morning, good afternoon. Welcome back to our channel. Hi, I'm Anna. If you're new, this is Aiden. This is Aiden, and this is baby Angela. Say hi. Hi. So we're back at Fort Williams, I believe that's what it's called, uh, park. Uh, we're gonna venture out and see what we can find here. Come here, Andrew. And uh, we're gonna go check out the beautiful lighthouse. Um, and we're gonna go to this place that's called the Children's Garden. Of course, we're gonna get some lobster rolls and take some pictures. And, take some pictures. and actually, um, we stopped all the way in the front over there because there was an artist. Um, he's from Scotland, uh, him and his wife. Uh, we actually purchased a couple of artwork pieces. Uh, they're reprinted, but they're still beautiful. Uh, just very nice gentleman and his wife. So they talked to us for um, quite some time. And then the lady next door, she was selling like jewelry um, from like sea glass and like driftwood um, items anyway. So we purchased one uh, Christmas ornament, uh, which is pretty. So we'll show you that a little bit later. But right now we're just gonna walk around and enjoy this beautiful day. It's really warm. It's muggy, but at least it's kind of like overcast. So it's uh, kind of not approaching this beautiful lighthouse, which I think, again, I'll insert the name for you, but I think it's called Portland Head House or Portland Head Lighthouse, I should say. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Andrew. So it's just, see, like if I didn't have my kids, I would go over there and then you get to see this beautiful view. Uh, but I mean, with Andrew, it's a little, it's a little risky. Aiden would do it. Look at all of this rose hip, hips, hip, hip, rose hip. Yeah, see it? You can collect it and make tea. Uh, there's two little toddlers making a lot of noise. So <laughs> it's just an FYI. Uh, let's see, they have this little gift shop and it keeps closing so early. Oh yeah, the little kids. I don't know if you need a mask. I think I have one mask, but let's see. Ace masks are required in the shop. State order. <laughs> Ten minutes in the shop. Come here. Okay, so I have like 20 masks in my car, but of course we only took one. So Aiden went into the gift shop over here and me and Andrew are just hanging out. Um, I don't really need anything and Aiden wanted to get something, so um, we're just gonna wait for him here because I already picked up, like I said, the prints. So that's more than, I mean, let's go look over here. Let's see, I can show you the coastline. Try? Well, be careful. Come sit down over here. So, see. We were, I don't know where we were, but we were right over there somewhere taking, um, taking our picture so that way we could have the view of the lighthouse. I was thinking to venturing out over there because you have to go from the top and then you kind of walk down. It's not too bad. Not the easiest, but definitely doable. I'm just obsessed with this lighthouse. Just so, so beautiful. Okay, so we're all done with the little gift shop. And we're just over here. So beautiful. Oh my gosh, there's a little chipmunk. <gasps> there's a chipmunk eating a rose hip. Okay, do you see him? He's right there. He's right there. He's gonna come out. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. That is the sweetest little thing ever. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous here. Gorgeous. Alright, so we made it to the top. This is like one of my favorite views from up here. It's absolutely 
beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I read somewhere online today that this is the most photographed lighthouse in the whole United States of America. Oh, hey there. All right, let's go find the children's garden. For flowers and plants. Okay, we're in the car. Oh my God, the light is crazy. It's really, it's so cloudy, but it is muggy today. So, Dying. I got myself some lobster rolls. So this one is the main roll um, that has chives on top. And this one I've never tried before. So uh, I'm gonna give this one a try. This one is a wasabi lobster roll. So she said that if you do enjoy the wasabi flavor, you will definitely like this. She did say like, it's not gonna like clear your sinuses strong, but she says it gives it a really nice kick and a really good flavor. Um, the kids are eating stuff in the back. We're gonna probably take like a 15, 20 minute break in the AC. Um, and then we're gonna go check out, I think it's called the children's garden um, on the other side of the park. Um, and I'll let you know what I think about the wasabi roll. And these were 4.5 ounces. I think they have two sizes. This is 4.5 and I think they were um, 18, 1895 per roll. Anyways, I'm dying to eat it. <laughs> I'll let you know if I like them. All right, so I had my lobster rolls. The wasabi, it's good. Can't say anything about it, but I felt like I was eating sushi because I put a lot of wasabi on my sushi. So it really felt like, like I was eating sushi. So definitely wouldn't get that one again. But I did enjoy just a regular main roll. Anyway, so we came to this beautiful garden. It's called, what is it called? Children's Garden. So there's lots of flowers. There's a little pond. Um, I don't know, there's like a tennis court. A little bridge a little this a little that so a, a lot of cute little areas um, so we're gonna explore and show you this gorgeous gorgeous place all right last time we were here this wasn't working all right boys give it a try I don't know about my iPad. <laughs> Andrew's like I'll do it well I watch his fingers Andrew wait come back no, 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 this way, this way. I don't think it's working. Nope. Oh my God, look at this place. It is just like, like a fairy tale little place. I think they should have the right. Like absolutely beautiful hidden gem. They have little tunnels for kids but I don't know it's kind of dark you're going all right go good luck bye <laughs> bye see you tomorrow thankfully it's a small tunnel and there's sunlight in there so come Andrew come on you're back? Okay, oh, welcome hey. back. Hey. What's up? Hey, you. Okay, let's go. Do you you want to do it again? Okay, go ahead, do it again. Yeah, we're going to go on that little thing. Oh, I think the slide is open today. There's a slide, and there's a. Uh... Come here, Andrew. I'm like a little treehouse thing. And over here, it's just like a beautiful little pond. So pretty. All right, let, let's go on adventures. Let's go. Let's be careful with the camera here, with the rocks. Hey, 
Andrew. Yeah, be careful, guys. Let me go first. Let me go first. Don't pull him now. Can you help? No, I'm good. Thank you. Oh! That's what I said. It looks like it's open today. Andrew, look, they have a slide over here. Everyone, go! Hold on, let me see. Okay, we did like a test run. Cause it's kind of like freaking me out cause it's a little bit like, it's like stone. Okay, sit down, sit down. Slowly. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. It's like slippery marble. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's so fun for the kids. I don't know, you're too big. All right, go. Go, Andrew. Be careful. But they closed it, but I guess they only opened it, and that's probably why there's so much new. Yeah, probably. Yeah. It's so beautiful and peaceful here. So many pretty flowers and birds. Be careful, guys. Now we came to this little beach area. It's definitely a little busy. Maybe we'll go right over there with the kids. Throw a couple of rocks. And, uh, and then we're gonna head back. Oh yeah, now he's like ready to get naked and go to the beach. Somebody was screaming now that he don't wanna go to the beach. I guess it's not like an official, official beach, but people tend to swim everywhere in Maine. Well, I might be wrong, but... Oh, Andrew, be careful. Every place I see, people are swimming. Not like in New York City. So, let's see. Lighthouse over there, far away, so rusty. Hey, <laughs> you! You're all covered in sand. Look at you. Whose belly is this? Already? Already, he's covered in sand. Go, go inside a little bit. It's cold. I don't want to get dirty. No, oh, my serious guy. It's very uncomfortable to sit inside a pool with sand. That's true. The water's pretty clear. Aiden's going to explore. He wants to know what's behind that door up there. We came to this side, it's like no one here. Got a little crowded on the other side. Hey guys, so we are back at our um, cabin, cottage, tiny house, whatever you wanna call it. Um, we had an amazing time at the Fort, no, Williams, what is it called again, Aiden? Fort Williams. Fort Williams Park. That's also where the lighthouse is. I will definitely include all the information because I keep forgetting all of these names. But I just wanted to quickly get on here. This will be the end of today's vlog. I don't even know what day we're on. We are on. Is it day nine or is it day ten? Um, I don't know, guys. I don't even remember. But anyways, I wanted to. The boys are having lunch, by the way. Oh, it's so blown out. Um, but I wanted to show you. 
um, the things that we picked up at the lighthouse. Um, the paintings that we got, I think they're so beautiful and yay for us supporting small business because it is so important. And we got to speak with the artist for quite a while and um, they're typically there from early spring until October and because of the craziness during this year, um, you know, they, they, they just, I think they said that they just started coming here last week. Uh, so anyways, I will also include um, his information maybe somewhere over here and definitely in the description down below if you like his artwork. Uh, it's definitely beautiful. He has reprinted items and he also has originals which were also very reasonably priced. Um, so anyways, so I'm going to show you that and then Aiden did go into the lighthouse, house and he was so sweet and he picked up that Krabby Crab for Andrew and he picked up a few souvenirs for himself like a little um, little thing that with the lighthouse and I think a magnet and stuff like that so anyways let me flip the camera and get to the table so I can show you what's here and then I'm going to eat lunch and uh, and have uh, a glass of Chardonnay okay so this is um, one that I really really loved I love this um, side of the lighthouse it's absolutely gorgeous so I actually ended up getting two of these uh, one for myself and one for my mom so it'll be a nice surprise for her when we see her on Friday um, he told me what size this was I want to say it's like 16 by 24 I think but anyways I'm gonna frame them um, and hang them up once we get home and this is exactly the same one oops my bananas and these were $40 so very very reasonable and he had the original one um, like this sorry there's my papaya and my camera um, he had an original an original one that was $450 it was gorgeous I think it was a little bit it was probably this size um, and yeah what an amazing artist amazing and then he said this one was from um from this year this was the new one that he just painted this year um but of course like i said this these are reprints uh, but it does have his signature and uh like i said i'll put all his information down below so you guys can check it out and like i said very reasonable these are like 40 dollars um so if you're into lighthouses and stuff like that um it's gorgeous this is the opposite side of the lighthouse so like this is i guess the back and this is the front and then um aiden decided to get one like this for himself and this one was uh i want to say 12 or 13 dollars and then the guy said because we spent over a hundred we were able to pick out one of his like postcards and he was also um very very nice and he signed it for aiden right here very lovely couple very lovely and here's his um information if you guys want to check him out really sweet man and his wife is amazing so much information she gave us about the area um and there i think i said it I think they were from Scotland originally I think I think I have to go back and see in my vlogs so yeah and then there was another lady right next door so she was selling um, little stuff like this from like wood and driftwood and um, so this is the same lighthouse so we thought that was really cute I guess this was from last year that she did it it was ten dollars so we supported her she had other she had a lot of jewelry with uh, like sea glass um, but she only took cash and this was 10 bucks this guy took the card which which made it easier and then Aiden picked up let me see so he picked up this one he has something similar and he had something else i don't know there was another one that was just the lighthouse 
without the, the house attached. So yeah. Anyway, so that's what we picked up. Um, just really happy to support small business uh, during this crazy time that we're in. And anyways, we're so happy with the quality. And uh, like I said, we had an amazing day. I think I, I burned, but you know, what's new, I always burn. Um, we did so much in that park. Just beautiful, beautiful day. And for the rest of the day, we're just staying at the campground. We're not going um, to the pool. I don't know. I don't think we're going to the pool. We're not going to the definitely not going to the beach. I think we might just use our golf cart and just drive around a little bit once the sun goes down and after I eat and after they eat and after everybody relaxes. Um, so that's about it. So we hope you enjoyed this vlog. Uh, we definitely had a beautiful day and uh, leave us comments down below if you have any questions in regards to our trip, this location and Maine. If we can help you, we'll definitely answer your questions. And uh, be sure to come back for more because we're still here for, I think, four more days. I'm sorry, I lost count what day it is. I want to say it's day 10 or maybe it's day nine. Anyways, I can't think. But thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you'll be notified when we upload a new video. And we'll see you real soon. Bye.